So, um, I arrived in Kathmandu. I'm off trekking tomorrow, flying up to Lukla, to the Everest region, and I'm really excited. And I just thought that I would go through what I normally take in my walking rucksack. I've got a 45 litre rucksack. Um, it doesn't need to be 45 litres, it can be, definitely be smaller. This is just what I have. Spare clothing, I've got a spare fleece. A down jacket, waterproof trousers, waterproof coat, and a woolly hat, because I get cold ears. Um, first aid kit, head torch, I've also got spare batteries, a pair of gloves, and a buff. I also have insect repellent, sun cream, a camera, like a notebook, a normal book for reading. I've got a litre water bottle, it's good to have some snacks. A walking pole. I've just got one, but if you prefer to have two, that's also fine. Um, yeah, so those are the main things that I would take with me when I'm walking. I'm going to go trekking tomorrow. Bye! Camino del Norte is a very different experience to the Camino Frances. It's much, much quieter. You hardly see any other pilgrims. But when you do, you're always greeted with a smile and a buen Camino. A normal cycling trip you'll be going from hotel to hotel and your luggage will be transferred each way. The bike and boat option, what you actually do is you unpack for one whole week and your boat essentially follows you from uh, town to town while you cycle during the day and then you get back onto the boat at night time. <laughs>